Hello everyone, welcome to the Nail Tip Show. Today I'll be sharing a, a nail design that some of you have requested. I have this on about a few weeks ago on my thumb and uh, like I said, you guys, some of you saw the video and requested uh, me to do this. Um, the reason I'm hesitating to, to, to do this at the beginning because uh, when I saw this, I dig in my one of my drawers and I found this and I loved it. So I, I thought it would be perfect for the holidays look. But then I couldn't remember where I got it. So this is why I didn't kind of don't want to do it because for that reason, I hate not to tell you where to get it. But I'm guessing it could be at Michael's or Hobby Lobby. So if you guys found it, please give me a link. Maybe some of you guys um, want to see it. Oh, know where to get it that that way everybody can go and check it out but yeah for today's uh, tutorial i'll be using uh, dch acrylic blending system i'm using the soft white the uh, kind of like a soft pink but really it it also has a really like a crystal micro glitter really fine glitters so it's a uh, princess alina uh, glass powder which is like crystal clear powder and some crystals of course and then the nun white top coat from Koopa and the blue gel and I'm using number 10 brush and you also need a small uh, short liner brush for the uh, glue gel and of course I'm also using this this is where that pull the look together uh, yeah so that's it um, hôm nay là những sản phẩm này em sẽ dùng ha là màu soft white màu soft pink của BCH ha và cũng là cái màu clear uh, mấy cái hột xoàn với lại cái nơn white top với một cái hũ treo để bỏ cái treo uh, glue để bỏ mấy hột xoàn lên với uh, cọ số 10 em sẽ dùng với lại cái uh, short liner brush ha so bây giờ chúng ta cùng bắt đầu đó trước khi em bắt đầu và em đã bỏ cái tip lên rồi ha so I already prepped the nails I put dehydrated and uh, acid free uh, primer on so to start off I just basically using a soft white and the the soft pink to give it like an ombre but like I said I put I work pretty quick because I, I want to keep it wet while uh, while it's still wet I can still put this one on top of it and uh, the only thing about this is that it does not really give you a sticky surface so um, that's why I want to attach it on while it's still the, the, the powder still wet so look my and that can I like and say you get soft white with soft pink bỏ lên huh Thì lúc mà em đắp á, thì em sẽ làm nhanh tại vì cái ombre á, it's just my background nó là cái màu là cái nền sau thôi so it doesn't have to be perfect. So bây giờ trước tiên em sẽ dùng cái uh, cái cọ ha, số 10 ha, em sẽ lấy một một cục medium uh, của cái uh, soft white and then I'm just gonna slowly work it down. Like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect because this is just like a little background of the look. So I don't really want a thick, uh, um, a thick uh, foundation. So then it, later, because you remember you have to encapsulate it clear as well. So I'm just working slowly and try to drag the powder to your entire surface. And I'm just gonna drag it, make sure it's all blended down. I see that I need a little bit more of the tip, so I'm just gonna add a little bit more of the tip right here. And blend that one. Make it smooth. Okay. And then you can see. And then I'm gonna use the pink. And for the pink, I'm just gonna same thing. I'm just gonna try to use it really lightly. It's really nice soft pink. And you just wanna blend that out. Like I said, the ombre is just like a little background. So now, while it's still kind of wet, I'm just gonna place it. You wanna kind of wait until it's kind of slightly matte a little bit. And I'm gonna place it and tie it. I don't want it all the way to my cuticle, so I'm just gonna do it right there. And then just slightly press it down. But you know what? The fastest way you could do is get a like a, a plastic film, that way it non stick, and then I'll just press it lightly down. And hold it for about maybe five to ten seconds. So then the 
the powder can dry with it because this is an, a plastic size so that it won't stick to your nail I'm just gonna press that down so now I'm just gonna take it and I'm just gonna trim the side so now that I trim all the edges I'm just gonna encapsulate everything with the clear okay And let it slowly go down. Okay, and then I'm just gonna try to encapsulate the rest of the of the cuticle down. Okay, and then you wanna wait until it dries. Then I'm gonna shape them so once it's dry about a couple minutes once it's dry i'm just gonna shape them so and đợi khoảng chừng mấy phút thì nó sẽ khô thì bắt đầu em sẽ dùng sơ sơ ha so make sure i top the skin now i'm have to bring the shape back so just make sure i file it underneath to give a nice straight line Okay, you know what? To speed up a little bit, I'm just gonna take the carbide bit. I'm gonna file it a little bit down so that way I don't have to sit and file too long. I'm just gonna go around the cuticle a little bit. I'm going pretty tight but very slowly, one direction. So at least have a cuticle, you might set it to the Be dumb, huh? Now I'm just gonna clean the edges. I'm gonna take, I'm actually take the length down a little bit because I did it too long. So I'm just gonna clean the free edge and then underneath the side as well. Especially when you do the encapsulation, you know, it's always kind of a little messy on the side a little bit. So I'm just going to take my e-file to kind of strain it out so that way I don't have to do a lot of shaping. As you can see, I don't have to do a lot of shaping because it's pretty much the thickness that I need it already. But I just make sure I have to shape the side a little bit because I could tell I... I want it to be a little bit more taper. Taper, I'm sorry. So now I'm gonna do the hand filing. Em muốn cho hai cái bên hông này nó thon lại thì bây giờ em sẽ dụi nó sơ sơ ha, bằng tay ha. Đây bằng máy thì đi không có được uh, đi cho nó ấy. So bây giờ I'm just right now what I'm doing just wanna taper both sides in a little bit. Okay. So now I'm just gonna take the cowboy bit again. I'm using the three in one. Uh, I'm thinning out the free edge slightly a little bit more. Change my bit to a sanding band. Sau đó em lấy cái uh, em dụ mỏng sơ sơ để em sẽ dùng cái cái sanding band này ha. Buff nó lại. So now I'm just gonna take this, my low speed. I'm just gonna buff the entire nail. And I'm just gonna uh, clean the nail. I'm gonna clean the nail. The nail, look, voila. I'm gonna clean the bottom as well. Okay. Now you can see, it looks really good. I guess because it looks good because I'm using the soft white. With it's not too white, and then the foil, the sticker kind of pops, you know. And now I'm just gonna put the top coat. So be your answer, John and Obama too. So you can see with by itself it looks good already but because I want to give it more like glamour look so I add some crystal to it okay and I'm gonna keep that for one minute so after one minute it's cured I don't have to wipe the top coat so now I'm just gonna use these crystals and I forgot to add the beads as well get okay, the crystal other uh, silver beads as well 
So bây giờ em sẽ dùng những hộp xoa này. So all the the crystal I'm using is part of the Glitz uh, Starter Kit collection. Uh, we do have it on the website if you guys are interested. Um, the kit comes with the gem gel and the crystal picker, and so with everything in the, with the complete kit. Okay, so you can check it out if you get interested. To start off, I'm just gonna pick up some um, the glue gel. I'm just gonna put it to the area that I want it. So basically, I'm gonna do it entire where the cuticle area at. And then the center. So các bạn cứ lấy cái 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 glue gel các bạn bỏ chỗ mà các bạn muốn. So basically, I'm just gonna go around the cuticle area, and then I'm just gonna pick the biggest one, the size 30, and place it right at the center. The reason I'm using this size because my thumb is pretty big, so I figured this will just kind of like um, go with the look. And then I'm gonna pick the, I think this is 20. And then just gonna leave us there. And then I'm gonna go in with the smaller on the side, which is this one, and on the side. Okay. I think I could fit another small one, so I'm gonna add another small one. So các bạn thấy đó, em chỉ dùng cái um, cái gel glue này, cái gel gel này á, thì nó nó sẽ dính giữa cái hột xoàn mình đều hơn. So các bạn muốn làm hột xoàn nó cho nó giữ chắc đó, thì các bạn phải để cho nó sát với nhau. Nó càng bám sát với nhau thì hột xoàn nó sẽ giữ uh, chắc hơn. Uh. I'm just gonna add a little bit more on the side here to make sure the gem is attached. And then I'm gonna pick some the silver bead and then attach it on the side. This also enhances the look, but it's also keep the crystal everything attached and it's kind of enhance the look a little bit more. So I'm keep doing it until I'm satisfied with the look. So các bạn cứ từ từ bỏ lên cho nó đẹp. Thứ nhất cái 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 crystal này á, cái bead này mấy cái hột uh, cái silver bead này nó làm cho cái hột xòe nó bám chắc với nhau. Thứ, thứ nhất, cái hai nó làm cho cái cái design của mình cũng đẹp hơn nữa. Now to add the teardrop, I'm just gonna add a little bit more on the side right here. And then I'm gonna pick the teardrop and just place it right there. And then before you put in the lamp and cure, you make sure everything nice and straight. And another thing too, if you have something like this, make sure you use a little of the, the gel and add a little bit on the edge right here because that way it doesn't have gaps and then it will stay a lot better. You just want to pick enough, a little bit thin enough where you can just put along the side. Okay, you don't want to add too much but just thin enough so it doesn't have any edges. Sorry, you see that? So I'm just gonna make sure I seal all the edges. Okay, that's it. And then before I put on the lamp, again, I wanna make sure I'm happy with the design. And if I need to make any last adjustment, I do it before I put in the lamp. Okay, so now this is what I do. I take this stick. Make sure everything is in the center. Now I'm gonna put in the lamp for one minute. After one minute, sau khi một phút hơn là em đã kêu nó là nó cũng giữ chắc rồi. So the glue is pretty much dry. Uh, the gel, I mean, it's pretty dried up. But to seal everything, and because you know it still has a slightly tacky layer. And then I'm gonna go back in with another coat of the non white top gel. And then I'm gonna put just around it. I'm not gonna put over and tie the crystal. Remember when you put crystal, do not put over the gel over and tie the crystal, just on the edges. And you can see here, I'm just barely have enough of the gel. Where can I add just the size and try to get 
along the edges especially here where you have the sharp edge right here make sure you put lightly right there I'm gonna wipe the brush make sure I do entire this side as well and again just the side just the edges not all over the entire look okay and then I'm gonna cure it one more time for one minute so after one minute, I'm just gonna put in uh, some cuticle oil. Okay. Sau khi một phút khô đó là em sẽ bỏ ra là em sẽ bỏ dùng cuticle oil. Thì các cái 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 tháp khốc mình không cần chùi ha. So đã cái đó là xong hoàn tất rồi đó. So this is the design. I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys could find the sticker on this. If you guys like, I said if you guys anybody found it please put a link in so we all can go look for it okay thank you so much thank you for the request i hope you guys like it it's pretty cool design i guess for the holidays and uh, you know with the crystals and the the sticker it, it gives really like a holiday look as well and it's so i feel like it's a little glamour look holiday look i guess it's good for any season so yeah that is it I hope you enjoy that. Okay. Um, and cũng uh, mong các bạn uh, thích cái, cái tutorial này và thử thì uh, I, I feel like cái hộp uh, với hộp xoàn với cái, cái sticker này nó làm cái kiểu này nhìn giống như cái holiday ha. Với lại nhìn nó sang, em rất là thích. Thì uh, em cũng mong các bạn uh, tìm được cái sticker này. Em, em cũng không biết em mua ở đâu, em có cái này lâu rồi. So, yeah. So that is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, be sure to subscribe our channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook as well. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope I didn't disappoint you with where to find the sticker. Um, again, if you found it, please give us a link. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next video. Thank you guys and mến chào các bạn.